The misconduct case against Livingston County Judge Teresa Brennan is moving forward to a full hearing before the Judicial Tenure Commission. Accusations against her include an affair with a detective who testified in a murder case in her courtroom. Seven investigator Jim Kirstner has been on this case from the start and spent the day at a commission hearing in Livonia. Judge Brennan and her attorney came here with motions arguing that the evidence against her should be limited and this entire process should be tossed out. Those failed and I talked with the judge asking her to address the serious allegations for the first time publicly. What do you say to the people of Livingston County? I have to go into court. Thanks. Her attorney tried to argue there's no evidence that her friendship with Michigan State Police Detective Sean Furlong was sexual and should not be part of this case. Furlong was the lead detective in the murder trial of Jerome Kowalski, convicted in Brennan's court and doing life without parole. It, it wasn't the blockbuster thing that these folks are going to make it out to be. The public probably thinks it is. We don't know the nature of their relationship during that time. All we do know is that it was sufficiently intimate, sufficiently personal, uh, sufficiently close that Judge Brennan needed to make much more of a disclosure than she did. A small group came to this hearing from Livingston County, including the son of Jerome Kowalski, who wants his father to get what he calls a new fair trial. I'm um, excited because it's the first time I felt um, there's something positive happening in this case, um, you know, regarding Judge Brennan and it ultimately affects my father's case. Brennan's attorney also tried to argue this judicial tenure commission process is unconstitutional, but the master, a retired Wayne County judge presiding over it, said this will go on. His recommendation on Brennan's fate is still up to a final review. The Supreme Court does not always agree with uh, the recommendations of the uh, of the Judicial Tenure Commission. So for now, Judge Brennan goes on trial here, if you will, October the 1st. In Livonia, Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News. All right, thank you so much, Jim.